For cheap games, MSP and PSN Money, check out my sponsor G2A, the link's down below in the description, and use the code RIG3 for 3% cash back. Right guys, Briggers here, and today I'm going to be showing you my predictions for the next marquee matchup, so if you guys will enjoy this video, and if you do, please smash the like button down below. So before we go into my four main picks of the week, just going to show you some other games that have a chance of featuring as well, and this week, I did keep changing my main four quite a bit like on this list, Impact vs Toronto, Fulham vs QPR, Barcelona Bilbao, they got a good chance of featuring, so it was a very hard week to pick my final four like games, so for you guys, potentially want to invest in some of these games in this list as well, I'm going to go into my main four picks right now. Right, so going into the first game for this video, so we have Limerick vs Cork, so I decided to pick this game, because next week got St. Patrick's Days of Thinking EA, may include one of the Irish League games, but at the same time this one is a risky one because I'm not 100% sure about, so for Limerick, when investing with them, pick up some of the bronze players at 200 coins to try and pick up the highest red ones possible, and then for Cork, they do have some silver players, but for the silvers, they cost around a thousand coins the second, which is quite risky in my opinion, and they're also only 65 and 66 reds, so um, not really a big rating boost, so I would go with the bronze players again for Cork just here, and once again, just pick up the highest red ones for 200 coins. Going into the next game now, we have Fenerbahce vs Galatasaray, so for this one, it's another one that I'm not 100% sure about, like it's a massive game, but... Fenerbahce featured in marquee matchups two weeks ago now and thinking it's possibly too soon for them to feature again but at the same time it's a massive game so that's why I decided to include in my top four so when investing in this game you don't want to risk a ton so for players like this guy you can pick him up a 650 through bidding discards like 620 so you're risking like 30 coins per card so um, definitely worth picking up a few of him and then for Galatasaray don't need to risk much with them as well so for their players Got a few rares, you can pick up for 650 through bin as well, so once again, pick them up that price, can discard for 620, barely risking any coins. For the teams though, you may want to pick up two players from each team, just in case there's a requirement to have two players from each team, and if that is the case, what I recommend doing, knock this to 400 coins, and with both clubs, you can pick up some players like this. Next up, we have Leon vs Marseille, so if this game went invest in with Leon, Pretty easy to invest, so for the gold rare players, pick them up for 700 coins through buy now. and if you can get them through bidding a little bit cheaper, try to do that, but most of the time, they do get bought for their buy now price. And then for Marseille, their players are a little bit more expensive, like as you can see just here, only two players below 700 coins, and if I knock this up to 900 coins, there's not many cards at this price, like for the rare cards, barely any on that page, so what I actually recommend doing the Marseille players, put this to about 700 coins, and then try and pick them up like this, because you can get quite a few of the rare players for 650, 700 coins like this for the um, non-rares. Can I just get them for 400 coins, 500 coins, quite a bit, so Marseille players, definitely try and pick some of them up through bid-in. Going into the final game for this video, and we have Boca Juniors first real play, so if this game would invest in for Boca Juniors, can pick up the gold players below 400 coins through bid-in, and also if you do put a bit of time into it, you can actually pick up these players at 300 coins occasionally, and if you do that, you're risking nothing, so if you want to, put some time in and risk no coins at all, and then for River Plate, you can do the exact same, so for their players, just pick them up below 400 coins for a bidding, and if you want to, try and pick up some of the 75s for 300 coins. So that will be it for this video as well now, so see you, Shuni Riggers, and hope you enjoyed this video, and if you have, please for like.